Well, the scientists have been warning us that droughts, hurricanes, rains will change, will increase in frequency and magnitude since 1994, when we signed the Convention of Climate Change. That is happening, is going to more extremes, especially in dry areas. And we are really, you know, measuring it now worse and worse every year. The tendency is more of doing engineering works, big reservoirs, big dams, irrigation channels. But we at FAO, we think that other uh, activities could be done. For example, better water management, you know, to go from traditional irrigation to drop by drop, to use more drought resistant plants and crops, that is possible. We have the research, we, we know them, but it means essentially a change in the culture of the people using water. Today, 70% of the, of the water of the world is used for agriculture, in some countries even more. And it's a waste, the, the way we manage the water. We need to change the culture and be more aware of using every drop better and better. And we need to rethink the policies. We need to teach the people how to use less water and produce the same uh, agricultural outputs or crops. We need to help the small landholder to be able to use the new technology, to, for example, to use the drop by drop and not only to wait for large uh, irrigation uh, dams and reservoirs, but, uh, but also the governments could do a lot, could provide uh, incentives for new drought resistant plants uh, in terms of uh, laboratories, uh, knowledge dissemination, and also in terms of organizing the communities and the, and the small landholders in associations and cooperatives and others, which will help them to transfer easier the technology.